Hey guys, Justin from Simplified Investing. I hope you guys are having an excellent weekend. Here is our weekly watch list video. Enjoy. So getting things started, QQQ extremely weak. And you'll remember we mentioned up here to look for that correction because we got this CPI print that came in here and all of a sudden we got this massive sell off. We formed this flag gap down that sold off, gap up that sold off. And now we're just putting in lower highs, lower lows, lower highs and lower lows here. Now, from this daily chart perspective, we could definitely rally here on Monday, but a macro perspective, we are flipping into a downtrend and we hit that correction phase of over 10% pullback here off of the highs, which we mentioned to look for from up here. So for me, longs are on the table, back over 453.56, target 457.12, and then this 471 area. What's really nice about this downtrend is you could still get a nice rally like this that then would put in a lower high like this. So you could get a $20 rally here on the market and we could still be in that lower high structure here. So for me, longs are on the table over 453.56 and also shorts are on the table below 444.95. And I want to note too, from a daily chart perspective, we are testing a huge region here. We had this really strong move up, but really strong moves up can be followed by really strong moves down. And we've really made this move in a month back to retest all of this structure here. So it wouldn't surprise me to see us hold. So using those two levels, 44495 to short and back over 453.56 to take longs here to the upside this week. And the first move is going to be Apple. It's the strongest mega cap name that we have. Earnings were pretty good. What would be awesome is a weekly buy over this high and really over 225, I think we could trade a very strong bar back up into these 52 week highs here and definitely keeping that set up on watch here. And when you go in to the daily chart here, if we get this failed breakdown, you can see we tested over prior day high and failed. But if we can get this strong move in this bullish momentum, we could easily move up into this 232 area and then up into 237, which would make this the higher low here on the daily chart for then that move higher to the upside this week. So definitely over 225 tomorrow, definitely keeping this uh, set up on watch, trying to break this structure here for then this higher low that I pointed out right here for that move to the upside this week. Amazon potential uh, bear trap washout that retested structure. So we retested 16085, which was this prior area right here, held very strong and nice uh, strength right here, similar to what we got here. So if we get anything over this 169.76, I think we can rally easily back up into 174 on this bear trap right here that then trades higher. So watching this over 169.76, to retest structure up here into 174 this week. And the last one, extremely weak, AMD to the downside below 132, eyeing puts with potential into 120.57. And we're setting up this one, two, three to the downside here in a really a, a small bear flag. So anything below right here, really liking shorts down into then this 120.57 area for that continuation move to the downside and looking at the weekly chart, very, very weak. We tried to rally up here, failed, slammed lower. So I think if we get this move lower below this 132 area, I do think we can see that sell off back into this structure down here. With that being said, that wraps up our watches for the week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let us know down below what you guys are watching. Thank you guys and I hope you all crush it.